Hi, I'm Vanessa Fisher in Yorkville for the Toronto International Film Festival. I'm about to speak with Fernando Tureba and Javier Marascal, the directors of the animated film Chico and Rita. the Intercontinental for the Toronto International Film Festival. I'm joined today by uh, director Fernando Tuerba and Javier Marisca. And they're here um, to premiere their movie Chico and Rita. Uh, could Hi. you tell me a bit about your film? Well, it's, uh, it's um, my first animation movie. I, I always dreamed to work with uh, Javier in, an, in a movie together. So one of the things that we like more in life is Cuban music, jazz, and, and the Cuban country and the Cuban people. And so we start with that, you know, uh, for, for making that movie together. And, and it's, it's a love story. It's, um, the story takes place in, in Havana, New York, in the 40s and 50s. And it's a love story of, of two very beautiful uh, young musicians, a singer and a pianist. And, uh, Chico is a pianist and Rita, she's a singer. And where did the idea for the film come from? Well, it comes because we really love the music and we came very often to La Habana. And also we are very good friends of Bebo Valdez. The, the movie is dedicated to him. Bebo is the, the, the most important living Cuban musician. You know, because he, he is not only a great composer, arranger, pianist and uh, musical director. So our friendship with him was very inspiring for making Chico and Rita. Also in this time was so nice, the fusion, the Cuban La Habana in New York musicians and the bebop, take it all this uh, African Cuban rhythms and they they make a fantastic new jazz. And the jazz changed completely after that. And what was it like to work together? Great. We are still our friends. <laughs> That's the most important part, I guess. Yeah, I think. Yeah. As far as the story goes, uh, it's primarily a love story. Do you think uh, jazz music and love go hand in hand? Before we start writing, uh, uh, he, Javier always told me this movie I like it to be like a bolero. A bolero is the Cuban uh, ballad, no, like a right. love song, no. So the movie is like a song itself, no, about these two people who meet each other and life, how life uh, separates them and then brings them together again, and uh, it's this love story, no, it's uh, like a song. Rita, in the end, she ends up choosing love over success and fame, do you think that's something that you would do? I think uh, uh, success is uh, overrated. No? I think success is a very sad thing. It's useful, makes your life comfortable, but uh, love is better and friendship is better. Absolutely. Yes. Yes, I agree. Yes? <laughs> yes, it is. Great. <laughs> She could have played Rita. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> If you do, uh, if you do a version with the non-animation, the Canadian remake, the Canadian remake, <laughs> real action. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us here, um, and good luck at the premiere of your film tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.